the second violins. This is your Il est né le divin enfant. It's French. Uh, video. Okay? So here's your A. E. D. And G. So I hope you're in the ballpark. Okay, so um, the beginning, uh, you got the first line is the introduction. You're going to play rest. Then you're going to play two, three on the G string. Rest. And that's going to be a high two on the G because it's a B natural. You're in the key of G major. If you notice, you have one sharp in your key signature. That means you have a high two on the G string and on the D string because you're in the key of G. On the A and the E, you have low twos. Okay? So you're going to play one, two, and this is going to be one, low two, and then on the G string, you're going to play high two, three. So you have one, right? One, two, one next to two on the A string, and then two next to three on the G string. So let's get those notes right. One on the A string, two, and then high two. They're an octave apart. I was looking up at my ceiling fan. That's why it sounds so a little odd. It's because I'm under a ceiling fan and I didn't cut it off. I don't think I can cut it off. Anyway, okay. So we're going to start at the very beginning. Okay, about like one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So it's going to be one. Up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Right? You don't have to retake your bow at all. Well, you, you do have to retake your bow for the next line. But I didn't mean between the between those four measures you don't have to. So you're going to go, the beginning is rest. 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 Right, then half notes. section between B and C, I think the trickiest part is remembering that on the D string you have a high two, F sharp, and on the A string you have a low two, which is a C natural. The slurs are a little tricky, okay? So if you'd like to practice just your left hand fingers without the slurs, I don't have a problem with that. So let's do that a little bit slower, okay? But let's get the rhythm right, but don't worry about the bowings right now, okay? So we're going to start letter B about like 3A1, A3A, A, low to one, ready, ready, go. Then three on the D. And then just practice it so that you can get the bowing. So let's try it with the bowing, but about that, about that, that slow, okay? Because you can back this video up and just practice it single notes with me. But here's where we're going to practice it with the bowing. So we're going to go down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, right? Okay, here we go. Ready, letter B. Let's try it with the bowings. Remember, low two on the A. High two on the D. And if you right now we're working on bowling, so if you don't get the twos right, don't sweat it yet. Here we go. Ready? Three on the D. Ready? Go. Right? And then letter C. We've played that before, because that's the same thing as letter A. Okay, 
So let's do letter D, okay? Because the last two measures are a little, little tricky. You have the magic notes there. Violas have one magic note. You've got two magic notes. And they're tough ones. You've got an E flat and an F natural going to third finger. You've got one, two, three, and then you get a left hand pizzicato. Okay? So the E flat's gonna be a low one on the D. It's got to be a low one. Pull that finger back. Now you don't moose your hand back. You move that finger back from the knuckle. You move that finger back from the knuckle. So I can show you. Move it back from the knuckle. Don't move your whole hand back. Just move that finger back from the knuckle. Move it all the way back. Okay. So here's your open D. And the note you need is a low one. Okay. Let's find those notes. Here's the low one, E flat. Here's the F natural. It's going to have a space. See the space between one and two? Here's a low one. Here's two. And that two would usually be a low two, but it doesn't feel like a low two because one is pulled back. One is usually here. One is here, right? I get my right on stuff. So one, two, three. Those notes are all going to have spaces between them. Because you pulled one back. Okay? You're used to doing this. Low two, next, and then three. But now you've got low one, two, three. One, two, three. Right? So one, two, three. Okay? Let's do that again. Find your one. Just the low one. As so low, far back as you can get it. Low one, two, three. Okay, and during that rest you have before the E flat, you got to get it together. Those are your money notes. I call them money notes. Because one day when you're playing for finances, funds, those are the notes that people are going to hear you play and go, wow, because they play those notes in tune, because those are the notes that make the difference. Okay, so let's start at D very slowly. Ready? And one. Rest. Low one. Okay, so practice that. Get your money notes. Okay, and this second like violin part is a really a nice second like violin part. So make sure you got it. You got it get down cold, right? And um, hopefully, I'll be seeing you sometime in November. I just can't drive yet. I got to get the okay for my doctor before I start driving, and that's a long drive. It's a two-hour drive, and um, it was my right leg that I have an artificial hip. Artificial. It's not even real. It's not the one God gave me. I've started freaking about that a little bit. Anyway, um, it's my right leg, and that's the leg you drive with, right? Your, your pedal, the brake pedal and the go pedal. So, ouch. So, I have to be very careful because I cannot dislocate this thing. So, um, lots of rules. Anyway, so um, practice for me, and I'm about to do your happy Hanukkah video, video, your happy Hanukkah video next. All right? Love you. Practice.